I get it. But this stage is hot. These performances that you're about to see are hot. If you don't already know this, you're about to see improv. Improv. That means that these humans are making up stories right here on the stage for you before your very eyes. And you're going to see long form improv. So that means there might be some narrative stories. There might be surprises. There might be songs. You never know. That's the thing about curious comedy. We're full of surprises. So thank you for coming to Dynamite PDX. First question, clap if you've been here before for this show. Welcome to the cult of improv. We're so happy to have you. Uh, so, uh, uh, oh, oh, they're going to get some suggestions from you. So I want to warm you up really quick. I'm going to ask you a few questions, and you just need to yell out. It's not like in grade school where you have to raise your hand. Just yell out your answers. So on the count of three, please tell me your first name. One, two, three. Yeah. Wonderful. On the count of three, tell me your very favorite color. One, two, three. Yeah. Beautiful. On the count of three, tell me one thing you really want to eat at if you celebrate your Thanksgiving dinner. One, two, three. Yeah. Beautiful. Excellent. I got so many suggestions from that, and I got so much energy. And because it's late night, we're just going to move right along. Our first team is a house team here at Curious Comedy. They are some amazing human beings who I know personally. So I really want you to give a huge warm welcome to Trillium. first because that's a fun office prank. That's not a fun office prank. <laughs> we were having, we were laughing it up. We, we were, we're not, we weren't laughing at you, we were laughing at you on the ground. It was very really funny. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, I didn't realize it upset you so much. It did. But instead of complaining, I decided to proactively write you a note reminding me to be kinder. Okay, so. Because I'm a big person who would never pull out a chair from someone as they were about to sit down. Yeah, so was that what these other notes are about? Yeah, are that's also... right. <laughs> okay. 
Well, this, I don't even really know what this means. This one, this says try. Yeah. <laughs> Last month, I had to do the reports all by myself. If you had done one of the reports, I wouldn't have had to work a 10-hour day. Try. Okay. Well, you come into work at 10.30 a.m. Try. I, you know what? The max has been so delayed Oh, lately the max. That I, I'm not trying to, you know, you really show off around the office like I could come in late just because me and the boss go fishing together. That's exactly what you're doing. You and the boss go fishing together, so you come in late because he's not going to bust you that for it. That explains his third note, I think. Yeah. Uh, this just says, fish are people too. That's right. <laughs> I'm the fish right. Son, uh, this is yeah, mom. This is the car that I, I learned to drive when I was 16 years old, and I think it's... Sorry, let me, let me get out of it. Okay. <laughs> Mama, I'm not, I'm not driving this piece of shit, Mom. And I saved it for you. No, no, this is... Saved it? It barely runs. Oh, but it moves. Oh, honey, honey, I've drunk this ever since I was 16 and I had Blondie playing in the car and I was with the window with my hair blowing in the wind. Oh, gosh, don't tell me another story about how cool you were in the 80s, Mom. Sit right here. Oh. Son? Yeah? I was so cool. <laughs> Listen, I had my right here is where your Aunt Rebecca sat. Oh my goodness. We had so much fun. We would do the drive throughs Cut to the 80s and the drive throughs Rebecca! <laughs> 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 Jackson, that's a great record. <laughs> It's 
carnival. And we're gonna get to the go oh. great beyond. We are gonna go to the great beyond. I'm gonna go first. Oh. Because I paid my ticket. No, I'm gonna go first. Mm. No, I, I've been one. Oh, you are horrible. <laughs> How did you get a death ticket before I did? How dare you call me horrible? I'm just a pre-planner, okay? When the rapture comes, I got a first-class ticket. You can't fault me for planning ahead. I can't fault you for planning ahead because you didn't include me. I was planning to kill you and then me next. <laughs> <laughs> what? That's the kind of love I had for you, honey. <gasps> I'm so touched. You were going to kill me first? Yes. You were going to not let me have to do it by myself? No. God, I can't believe I totally stiffed you on a ticket then. I mean, I had I had a, a booked to go to the third star outside of the Big Dipper. I mean, it's really romantic up there. I hear, at least the brochure says. Oh, honey, I, I was just I was just planning for us to go to hell. <laughs> uh huh. Hell? Yeah, I mean it's hell. Think of all the people who are normally at yeah, church. like all your ex girlfriends are gonna be oh, in the hell. Not this again. Not this again. They don't mean anything to me, but yeah, they'll all be down there. Yeah, and you want to take me? I am not. at the entrance to town, so I tend to see everybody. Yeah, well, I'm just here from state, and I need a state hat. You're here from state? There's a new yeah. state hat. Oh, fuck, that's a big head. I've got to get another box. Well, you said all sizes fit all. Yeah, 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 just some of the sizes don't, we, we keep way in the back, because they only come out for really cool dudes to visit town. That's Cassandra. She's going to get a hat that's going to fit whatever you have happening there. Perfect. Cassandra, give me the biggest one you got. Okay, here. Oh, don't, don't yell at the people that work here. I'm she, so sorry, no, I'm, Cassandra. I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry, this Cassandra. Is, this is the biggest I could find, and I'm really sorry. You're going to have to, like, unsnap it to the last snap. Okay. Yeah. No, I know it looks just like a big tin bowl from my grandma's house, but uh, oh, it's forgot, a hat. I forgot the logo. I'm just here. Okay, I'll be right back. Green. <laughs> <laughs> Looks good, sounds good. What do you think? Take a look at yourself in the mirror and let me know what kind of person you think you are now. Do I look like, I look like the football players with my tin hat on? Yeah, I can see that too. We're looking in the same mirror, brother. <laughs> you know, is, is, that, is that Eastern State, Western State, or Southern State? We Western State. Western, guy. Uh, okay. Get the, yeah. I gotta get the logo. It's my girl Cassandra. Cassandra and I have worked really here cool. for two years. We started on the same day. The same day? Are you guys like together? We approach every day as if every customer's need is our shared need. Like, I feel like I have a huge head right now just because you do. And Cassandra. <laughs> Let me check this Look mirror. Look at this mirror. See how you feel. Okay. Uh, I go to state. Uh, I'm in I'm in town just for the weekend, visiting my brother-in-law. Brother That's a wife. Wait. Wait. <laughs> what? I'm gonna get another hat. Okay. I'm from the 101. I drive the 80 miles a day and stop say occasionally. More, say more details <laughs> about my life. Oh. Say more about my life. Okay, and and it's always full. The truck's always full of hats. My, and I, my best friend's name. My, my best is friend's name is Eric. Eric. Yeah. Uh, hey, what are you, what are you doing after this? I, I'm just trying on hats, seeing which one I like best. We're gonna go watch hockey down at the Slap Shack if you want to come check it out. Uh, I 
I love Flapjack with Eric. Yeah. Uh, I said slap, slap. Wait, wait, hold on, okay. Listen, Tony, you owe me money. You gotta give it to me today. Today? I'm good for it tomorrow. Nope, nope, I give you a pass every single time, Tony, and it's, it's, you owe me, you owe me. But I promise tomorrow I'm gonna, I'll pay double what I was gonna pay you today. You said that last time, Jeremy. I think by now you owe me about 4,000 doubles. <sighs> doubles? Listen, if you're gonna bet on the horses, you gotta bet with money, and I'm sorry, Tony. I, I'm gonna have to take one of your fingers. What? <laughs> but I use all of them. It's what my dad told me I have to do. I'm so, I'm so sorry. Like, you know I don't like to do this, but I, I, I have to. I have to. I gotta get your money, and you know, we've been family for so long. A uh, friend of yours? Yes, 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 Dad? You gotta take your finger. <laughs> she's a piano player. I don't care if she's a piano player. I saw that recital, too. The way she played that Bach made me cry, but you gotta take her finger. <laughs> Dad, I This is our family. Let me just give her another chance. I didn't consider that. <laughs> no, I gotta, I need to teach you resolve. When you say you're gonna take a friend's finger, you take that finger. Even if they make it all good. Okay, I, I, I will, I will, I will, like, make, make you Go so proud. Go talk to her. Make you so proud. What if, uh, you took your dad's finger instead? It seems like he's a weird western mobster. He had, like, a western accent. And I feel like that doesn't go with your cool guy vibe. Okay, uh, Elizabeth, you're so, you're so... I'm so sorry. So please don't do it. He, he said I just had to take it. But are, are you, you're not going to use a knife or anything? You're just going to yank it off with your brute strength? Now, when you take that finger, yes, you, might be, you might be tempted to use a knife. Uh-huh. Uh-uh. <laughs> what am I supposed to use? <laughs> well, knife's too easy, OK? You use whatever you got around you. You get your wiles out, like I do when I'm on the farm hunting, We're also working for the mob. You know, I have to keep my head on a swivel. I got two jobs, OK? <laughs> Yes, when I need yes. to get something, I take it. Okay, I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it, I promise. All right. I'll, I'll make you so proud. Good. squeaky shoes in Starbucks, or do you mean squeaky shoes will be like Starbucks? And I don't think either is going to really help clarify. Uh, Stacy, he's ready! Sta oh, <laughs> yeah! Okay. Hey! Hi, Mikey! I'm ready to go! You look 
great. Thank you. Uh, I really, uh, I guess I'm going to go there. I really like your shoes. You do? Oh, my gosh. Daddy likes my shoes. Oh, no, you don't need to. He, I don't, I what see. What a good boy. Okay. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> Your first kill. <laughs> I just, I'm so proud, honey. I never thought I would be able to swat a fly, that, but it feels amazing. Right? It's like godlike powers of killing insects. Oh, wow. <laughs> and protein. You've learned about the protein. Dad, you've taught me everything I know, and I'm so grateful but I'm hungry for more fly blood. Oh, honey. Yes, we can. It's not just flies you can eat, too. I mean, there's millipedes and things like that down here. I'm so glad we decided to move to the forest. That's right. Here, just try, just try a little millipede. Mm -hmm. This tastes like a millipede bucks. Oh. Like a million bucks. It was a stretch. It's, no, it's OK. <laughs> it's OK. I like when you stretch your huntsicles. <laughs> She's here, it's fine. I know, but she just left them. Her mom left first, and then they left. Yeah. Now, should we get back to these, uh, <laughs> uh, you know, that classic food we always be eating? Yeah. I'm gonna start with this water thing. <laughs> I know we got that in the cage. I know we're squirrels, but I'm gonna go run on this thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I like that she put us in the hamster cage when she found us. It was uh, really kind of her. Yeah. You know, it gives us a lot of time to think about us. You know, they put a girl and a boy together for a reason. Okay. Go on. <laughs> well, I, that's, that's all. I, that's a fact. That's a fact that I wanted to state. Hey. All right. Cool. So we're, we're close friends. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> nuts. That's what I was trying to think of. Oh, nuts. We're at nuts. <laughs> Oh, I'm Audrey. 
Hi, I'm Bill. Um, to get us started, I would love to know how you feel about the upcome hol upcome upcoming hey! uh, the upcoming holiday next week. How does that make you feel? Full. 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 I'll take full. Okay. And uh, speaking of, is it like my family always has soybeans at Thanksgiving because my grandfather was a soybean farmer. Uh, is there something special that you guys always do with Thanksgiving? <laughs> Neat. <laughs> Irish? Oh, oh hey. Yeah. Great, great. We're the tip. with pleasure. Cool. You're judging me right now, I aren't you? I just thought maybe you'd clean your apartment. You knew I was coming over. <laughs> I want you to see me in my natural state. <laughs> wow, I just, there's so much talk about you. really thought you were going to win that Xbox, huh? God! You know, you know, the human mind does not calculate um, pop, uh, probability the way that you think it would. I'm just, I figured, like, if I have at least 20 of those, I'd get an Xbox. Yeah. Yeah, okay. it wasn't my most thought out plan. Yeah, clearly not. I just, Seth, I don't know. This is just like, like I knew you were like working on growing up, but this I'm is a like transition. a slap in the face of adult childhood here. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, my I, movie posters are framed, I'll have you I was just gonna know. say, your movie yeah. posters with the matching action figures, like, if you sold these, these actually might make you money, Seth. Why would I sell those? That's my childhood. I don't know. You could finally move out of your mom's if you sold them. <laughs> Grow up, become an adult. I don't know. Kelly? Seth? I told you about me and my mom. She's a cool mom. She is. She's a cool mom. Just because she gave you a book that said, I'm a cool mom, does it make her a cool mom, Seth? No, no, no. She gave me the book, and I gave her the t-shirt that says, I'm a cool mom. She wears it. <laughs> of course she would wear it, Seth. She thinks she's a cool mom. She is a cool mom. She's... How dare you? Okay, Seth. Cool, cool, cool. I see I'm coming on too strong with pushing you towards this. So let's just take it back a notch. Take it back a notch. Why don't we, why don't you just roll out the Ikea rug, at least I bought you. You know, spruce it up a little. Fine. Great. Except, it's holding up this projector box mm -hmm. that I have. Yeah. And if I take it down, the projector box comes down and then how will we watch TV? Hmm? Yeah. Hmm? Hmm? Cool. Well, Think about that? Yeah. Mm. Why don't we move the bookshelf to there, and then you don't use a rug that could fall over and kill you at any point, Seth? Do you like to live as if you might die at any minute? I like to live dangerously, Kelly. Okay, don't walk at me and say that you like to live dangerously. That's alarming to me. How about I just stand here and say, I like to live dangerously? I just and, can't, then, and then walk. I can't catch a I just can't laugh at you. Like, why are you wearing a button-up shirt? Like, all the way. Like, let your hair down. Like, I just want to make you so cool. Like, I've been your friend for, like, five years now, and I know you want to date. I'm, we're friends. You know, I made that clear. But, like, you have so much potential. I mean, like, this is, like, a really cool bed, you know? It's a race car. I <laughs> I know it's a race car, and even though it's a race car, it's still cool. It's cool, you know. And you got a cool Bon Jovi poster, and there's a lot of people who would be into that. You just can't keep saying your mom is cool when you're with girls, okay? Let's do a simulation. Oh God, not another simulation. We okay? have Fine. to get you to the point where you don't sweat to your knees. Okay, Seth? <laughs> okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Well, where are we? Where are we? I, I'd like an environment. I'd like an environment where I am. Great. Let's Are eat. we at a bar? Are we at a, are we at a movie? Are mm -hmm. we at a... Olive Garden. 
<laughs> I think the Olive Garden would be a good starting off point for you. Okay. Sure. <laughs> that was such a good start, Seth. You complimented really? me, but why, what was that other part? I don't Let know. me paint you a picture. What were you going to continue? I, I want to see where you want to go with that. Continue that thought. I like that. that Let going? me paint you a picture, like in that movie Titanic. Nope, 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 nope. That aged you, okay? I, wanna, I don't want to know where you are. Now. Let me okay. paint you a picture, like in that movie A Star is Born. <laughs> do, do they paint pictures in that? I mean... It's about country music stars. I wanted to see oh. it, but you're like, I don't want to see that. Whatever. Oh, God, okay. I don't. It's about country music stars. Who wants to see that? Great. Okay. I've already been here for a few minutes now. Breadstick? <laughs> Yum! This breadstick's so great. So I, I noticed that you didn't list a profession on your profile. She's going to ask you. You need to be ready for this, Seth. I freelance. I'm a, um, um, I mean, my training is, do, do I have marinara sauce here? Is don't that, ask me if I no, have No, 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 I don't, no, do I have, do I have it? I feel like I have marinara sauce. Seth, this is a simulation. There's no marinara. <laughs> it's just your spit. You're stalling. So it is. What? What industry are you in? I'm You're a freelance a intern. <laughs> I am a that freelance a intern. Thing, Seth, that's not a thing. Just say that you're in the tech world. She'll not want to go into it. I do things with tech. I do things with mobile devices. I'm online. <laughs> um, I'm an influencer. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever you don't have an answer to her question, ask her something about herself. What do you do in your free time? <laughs> yeah, but like, tone it down. Be casual about it. Like, well, what do you do? What do you do in your free time? <laughs> That's pretty good. Uh, oh, you know, I have a cat business. <laughs> <laughs> a cat business? I feel like the girl you date is going to be really into cats. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> She's like, oh, You know I cat. have allergies. Why do you think... <laughs> I feel like that's going to be the pinnacle of your relationship. You're going to get deep in it, and she's going to be like, are you going to move in with me? And you're like, are you going to give up the cats? And she's going to be like, how could you give up your cats? And I think that's how it's going to go down. Why are you putting a crossroad into a hypothetical relationship? I don't know. It adds stakes to the sim simulation. Okay, I know what I'm building towards. Do you like cats or not? That's how I'll know in this simulation for me. I don't like cats because they make me wheeze. You're an and then she would storm out. That was pretty good, Seth. That was like a pretty good run. We like almost got to like ordering our entrees. You know, so you, you know, Kelly, this is this is too much. Yeah. This is too much. I I'm not good at simulations. I'm not. I mean, I'm good at simulations online. I'm good at simulations on my PS4. I'm good at simulations. You should just have a virtual girlfriend. Yes! Get into a live chat room and then just be like, hey, want to meet up in IRL? And then she'll say, no, I'm in Japan. And you'll be like, perfect, let's just continue virtually. You know? What if we 
could go beyond that. What, what, what if she's a hologram? Okay, I feel like you've been building up to this since I got here! Oh, god damn it, Seth, you've gone really far! Oh my god. Why is she wearing a French maid outfit? Really? She couldn't be, like, empowered? Why does she have to I gave like her several ensembles! K-pop? Yeah, great. Yeah. <laughs> Teacher, interesting, okay. Po sexy pop? Yeah, sexy pop. Politician, great. Okay, that's, okay, yeah. Okay. The tentacles were a bit much. Yeah! <laughs> Finish the steak, everything's free. Okay, let's go, 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 go. This is, hey, 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 hey. This is going on Instagram. Oh, Dad, I just want to make you proud. <laughs> <laughs> Every member of our family has eaten the 86 or 86 ounces of pure goddamn American beef. You know, this means a lot to me. This means a lot to me that you're willing to give things up for a family tradition. Yeah, well, you said you'd pay for college, so here I am. <laughs> here, I, here I am! I mean, keep chewing. I don't know, okay. Keep chewing. I mean, think of it this way. Like, the animal's dead already. Yeah, that's true. It's dead already. Like, like, any sort of personal hang-ups you might have on this, like, give them up. Give them up. Because, like, you're part, you're part of the chain now. The food chain. Well, I'm a part of the food chain even if I'm not eating meat, Dad. Like, I'm a part of the plant chain. <laughs> no. Or, like, the, the soy See, meat see, meat see, meat. see, see, in, 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 in the pictures of the food chain, it's always tiny fish, slightly less tiny fish, slightly less tiny fish, Big fish, shark, human, man. <laughs> but the way you want to do it is, I'm a little sprout. And you jump all the way to human without all the different little things that come in yeah, between like, that. There's the sprout, and then the farmer who grew the sprout, and then the- But you don't the eat the farmer. <laughs> no, they're, they're still part of the food train, Dad. I'm in an economics class about food scarcity and everything. And Is that what you think? Is that what this is all about? <laughs> well, I, cause I, here, here's, here's how I took it. I took it that you were finally giving in to a family tradition that extends back five generations. I mean, look, every, every fall, around every Thanksgiving, a member of our family, and I, you've heard this before, but I'm going to do it again. I have heard this. I was driving along U.S. Route 40, and I saw a sign with a smiling cowboy that says, Earl's House of Beef, <laughs> home of the 86er. <laughs> and you know what I thought to myself? I Earl, thought I that is going to be my Earl, next Earl. meal. And so it was. And I went in and I said, I'd like to speak to Earl and order the 86 ounce filet and eat it so that 
in one hour so that my entire meal is free. And so I did. And your mother was a waitress at Earl's, and we fell in love. And your two older brothers also did this when they turned 21. And I just thought that maybe you would continue that tradition. I have eaten half of this poor dead animal. Can't we call it good? No, because if you don't finish it, we have to pay for it. God forbid you pay $12.99. <laughs> Potato's supposed to make you full. Full? It'll make you full before you get to the things that really matter. <laughs> Roger. 
Roger. This is the fog that we live within, Roger. This is the fog, Roger. Marjorie, put your glasses on. Put your glasses on, Marjorie. You're being dramatic again. This Roger, this is the fog. Okay, I can see it too. This is a little... Yeah. This is not just you. This okay. is... No! All right. This is the fog that we live under. Marjorie, what? Why did you bring the fog into the house, Marjorie? <laughs> I feel like I'm just enabling you by going on fishing boats. Hey, listen, Pops. Daniel. We need you. No, you don't. We need you. Still you don't need me. We need you, Pops. You're still valuable. Boys, you should cast off now. No. You Dad. should cast off now. Pop, don't you want to tie that rope? Don't you want to tie that rope? Don't you want to tie that rope? Pop, move. I'm pushing you out to sea. No. you should understand as my ward. <laughs> yes? I don't like when children look at me. And I don't like when children eat. <laughs> and I, mm, you're looking at me. <laughs> 
And number three, I, and I, I don't like children in general. That's your third rule? You just don't like children like Yes, kids? yes. But I'm very warm and loving when I have to. <coughs> Did my parents say they'd be back soon, or...? No. No, they didn't. I'm not sure they're ever coming back. Uh, I mean, Father said he had to fight in the war, but... <laughs> <laughs> there is no war, child. What? That's adorable. <laughs> 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 It really just goes to your soul. <laughs> All right, I actually prefer to eat alone. It's childhood trauma. <laughs> Getting in front of people makes me nervous. I am not. That part of your life is over, although I bear a striking resemblance to her. My fist. Sprinkle, 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 sprinkle. Margaret, what are you? What? Oh, God, what? I'm still the Santa. I'm still the Santa. You don't, no, sir, 
Sarah, you don't have to say the Santa. Yeah, you just say Santa. Santa, okay? It's really kind of pretentious, okay? We but, talked about this. But you're my, you're, you're my elf. Don't, don't say well, it. You're the elf. Thank you, thank you. You're the yeah, elf that are my, elves. you're, you're yeah. like my, my sons. Okay, we're unionized now, yeah, okay? Yeah, like, but you're like my sons, and, and I, I want to make sure that you can run this place without me. Well, don't talk like that. Yes. Because I'm broken. I'm just. I'm broken. I'm broken. Whoa, I'm like broken. A like a broken. Okay. Like a. Like a. Like yeah. You. Remember Santa. last year when there was that um that little Jack in the Box? Yeah. Then you would go do 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 do, and then it's nothing would happen. Right. We build Jack in the Boxes. We you, know what right. they are. Right. I'm sorry. Jimmy's face nice. Yeah, that's okay. Well, you know nice. what? You know what? I lost both ears for you, Santa. They got cut off. Well, they just got clean. No, I just look like a regular yeah, human. Uh, you're a, you're it's embarrassing. It's yep. embarrassing. It's embarrassing. But it's dedication. It's dedication. And so, this year, I'm not doing it. Whoa. This is Christmas? I'm not doing Christmas. What? Whoa, don't. No, 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 I gotta take care of Santa. And you gotta take care of Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> children and treat them well and then bake them like a ham in the oven. Christmas. 
Santa, give me a hug. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, Santa. Oh, Fog, boy. Fog, you are my ward now. Uh, okay, <laughs> do I... No, Fog, you... No, stop. <laughs> <laughs> now, there's plenty of people I want you to annoy. To anoint or annoy? Annoy.